Welcome back, Seth Bling here, and today I want to show you how to make floating islands in Minecraft. And it's really easy because of a little command block contraption I built. Let's just watch the island form. Now this is extremely laggy, <laughs> as you can see it's going pretty slow uh, because of basically all the lag caused by lighting updates as this island gets moved up into the sky. It's done, it leaves behind kind of a hole, a crater, where the island was lifted up from. Uh, so this is the command block contraption that you can use. Uh, if you want to import this into your world, all you have to do is you know, import it with mcedit and push the button to get this island maker bow. <coughs> normal bows will behave normally, but this island maker bow is a special one. Now there's some pretty cool things you can do with it, like let's try it right here. Uh, it'll bring any terrain that's on top of it along with. You can see I'm actually, actually lost some of the... Um, some of the gravel there, uh, but it, it includes like water for instance, so you can see it looks really cool actually when you have floating islands with water coming off of them. That definitely looks very very cool. Uh, what else can we do? Let's try it in the middle of a forest. Basically it'll just pick the spot where you shoot the arrow and it will lift up the whole area around that. So there we go. It's just lifting it right up. It cut this tree in half. You can see here's half of the tree, here's the other half, and yeah, it's just really simple to use. This is, you could definitely make a pretty cool looking survival map with this. Uh, imagine like a UHC played with on top of floating islands. <laughs> could be kind of cool. Definitely a lot of mobs will spawn in the craters left behind because they are pretty well um, covered. But yeah, I mean it looks really cool though I think. Anyway, so like I said, if you want to try it out for yourself, there is a schematic download in the video description. You can just download it import it with mcedit or whatever else you use and you can make islands for yourself. That's about it. Thanks for watching.